Hello, I'm Dr. Pat Nardini, naturopathic doctor. Today I'm going to talk about an important nutrient. It's one that many of us don't get enough of, increasing the likelihood of developing a wide range of health conditions. The nutrient I'm speaking of is iodine. First of all, what is iodine and what is it good for? It's a naturally occurring substance like a mineral that the body uses to keep healthy. For example, the thyroid gland absorbs iodine and uses it to make thyroid hormones. These hormones are then used to stimulate your metabolism, that is, give you energy, help to maintain healthy weight, and keep you warm. Insufficient iodine can lead to an underactive thyroid gland, and even enlargement of the thyroid gland, a condition called goiter. But many other areas of the body need iodine too. Some examples include the adrenal glands, ovaries, breasts, prostate, stomach, the skin, and muscles. They all require iodine for optimal function. If these tissues don't get enough, it may lead to certain conditions like lack of sweating, fibromyalgia, and cysts of the ovaries and breasts. It's also very important for a proper brain development. In fact, babies born to mothers with low iodine levels tend to have lower IQs. And iodine protects against cancer. It causes cancer cells to commit suicide so that they can't go on and form tumors. So how do you find out if you're low in iodine? One way is to get a 24-hour urine test from your doctor. You can also get a rough idea of your iodine status by using what's called the iodine patch test. You paint one inch square of iodine tincture onto your forearm, and if the square disappears within 24 hours, it's possible that you're low on iodine. In that case, go get a urine test done. How do we make sure that we get enough iodine then? Kelp, a sea vegetable, is the easiest way to get iodine in the diet. It can also be taken as a supplement. Good ones include Lugol's iodine solution, iodorel, and nascent iodine. Of course, if you're thinking of supplementing with iodine, check with a qualified health practitioner to make sure you're getting the correct amount. And remember that iodine is important for more than just your thyroid. Thanks for listening. For ongoing information and tips about your health, subscribe to my YouTube channel and visit me at nardininaturopathic.com.